can you read question number 14 yes a man donated 1/10th of his money to a school 1/6 of the remaining to a church and the remaining money he distributed equally to his children if each child uh, gets 50000 rupees how much did the man originally have so we have to uh, focus on remaining yeah the word remaining is important can you see that i am highlighting i am underlining the words so that it is clear yes okay let us start so each child gets 50000 so they have given us the final value as 50000 okay let me just go through what you have done fraction of money given to school 1/10 okay this is fine fraction of money given to church 1/6 but this part is incorrect they have not given 1/6 they have given 1/6 of remaining the word of is important yes no okay so what no. was remaining Uh, no, nine tenth, nine tenth. Nine, nine tenth uh, one six of nine. One six of nine by ten. Okay. So nine, so, so nine upon sixty. Yeah, you can reduce it also. Yeah. Okay, so you can take nine upon sixty if you are taking LCM of sixty. That is fine with me, but you can reduce it also. Three times three, three times two. So it would be three upon twenty. Yes. Three upon twenty. Now, uh, second part. The remaining he distributes equally among three children. Remaining. So how many he has distributed as of now? He has distributed. So currently he has distributed fifteen upon six. One upon ten has been given to the school, and three by twenty has been given to the yeah. church. Ah, uh, the church, isn't it? That much has been distributed. So let me just rewrite two upon twenty plus three upon twenty. That means five upon twenty. He has distributed already. Therefore, remaining. Me. How much part is remaining? Um, fifteen upon twenty. Okay. Now this is distributed into three uh, kids. So each uh, child gets fifty thousand. But I have to find first of all in fractions, na. No? So fifteen yeah. upon twenty divided by three. Three. Fifteen upon twenty divided by three. I'm doing it here. So fifteen. Again, what will be the answer? One upon three. Um, five. Yeah. Five upon twenty. Every child gets five upon twenty. Yeah. Every child will get five upon twenty, or one upon four, isn't it? Yes. And this value is represented by fifty thousand. Yes. Isn't it? So yes. therefore, can I write? If I take the total value be x, so if I write start the question by. uh this thing that let total money be x that means 1 upon 4 of total is 50000 so after that x equals to 50000 Multiplied by four, and that's two lakh for us. So, I hope the answer is correct. Yes. 
okay any doubt in this no hope you understood the mistake the word remaining you were not focusing on whenever you have the yes. word remaining you have to subtract from the total that is one fraction is always total is one 